Oh, here we go. Who am I going up against? I'm going Caledorian first, huh? Sean, if you can be a good boy and stand here at all times, I'll be super happy. I'll be extra happy. He put up traps in him. Can I find a way to attack him without hitting any of the traps? Can I do anything about that? I might be able to walk to the first trap. And we're gonna stun him here. And what buffs do we have? Nothing good. I actually got a really good buff right now. Actually solid buff. Wow, he actually gets a heal throw, doesn't he? Yeah, he does. Yeah, he does. Can I stun him again? Yes, I can. And he dead. And he dead. And he's dead. Here we go. Who's next? Is it a Felman? Is it my buddy Felman? It is my buddy Felman. Oh god. Blind him, maybe? Blind him. Is he gonna shrink that? Will have dots on me for a little bit longer. I really don't want to have dots on me, man. Dot for a little bit longer. Here we go. Why do I have two flags? Is it me or do I have two? I totally have two flags. I'm like a butterfly. I'm like a beautiful butterfly. Oh. There's a lot of that damage going out. And maybe I can reset. I mean, I caught a vanish. The crows are on me, but they're not getting me out. So that's good. So, although I don't know how the crows are not getting me out or damaging me. For that matter. That was a lot of my cooldowns out just now. Felman has Relentless. Oh, it's gonna be sucky. That's gonna hurt. Yeah, that's definitely gonna hurt. Yeah, definitely gonna hurt. Unless I can somehow run away at all times, basically. Parry? This is good, this is good for me. Okay. Uh, I just, I'm just gonna hit the pet for a bit. Get my cooldowns back. Okay, Felman is gonna go for a heal for sure. I just gotta stop it. Not the best roll I've ever gotten, but it's okay. I can reach him though. I have that reach. Cloak through all that. Stun him there. And finish him off. Survival Hunter. Yikes. Who's up next? Is it a Roxigum? Ooh, that's gonna be rough. Now, a Roxigum is a hard counter for what I do. Hard counter for a rogue. He's also an orc and he has a trinket, so that's gonna be rough. But I think he's letting me reheal, so I appreciate that. My question is, I wonder how fast is it gonna go for the eye? I won't blame him for going fast for the eye, but yeah. Can't blame him. Not really. Uh, where are we gonna have him at? Oh, do I want to trinket that? Yeah, I do. Yikes. Uh, gouge that maybe? Yeah, I think so. And vanish. So I don't take damage from this at all. Oh, that's actually pretty good for me. Dude, next stun, I think he's dead. I think he's dead next stun. Unless he does something. Unless he karmas this. He probably will karma me though. Yep, he did. If I can break out of with a parry, I think I'll be okay. That's a lot of damage coming out. 
Can I kill them? No, I can't. Unless I have a really good buff, and I don't. Do you have cooldowns? Yeah, not really. He has a stun though, so that's good for him. <sighs> yeah, I don't have anything. Not for him. Oh, I'm dead. Da -da 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 -da. It's okay. I bow down to you. I had him so close, but not quite. I didn't quite have a cooldown lineup for what I needed. Not quite perfect. Really close though. So Roxica takes me out. Sean going up next. Sean getting ink capped in the opener. What does Roxica have? No karma. Should have a karma available. Does juke Sean as he dragon kicks over to him. Tiger Lust is on his trail. Sean is trying to get up to Roxica, trying to slow him. But as soon as the slow comes in, another dragon kick out. Sean getting ink capped again. Roxica's doing a fairly decent job. Keeping him away. Sean finally got Roxico pinned. Gonna go for a stun serenity and everything. Orc versus an orc. Maybe Fist of Fury to follow up. Go ahead. She was about to Fist of Fury. The orc. Racial got him out a little bit faster. Defensive Fist of Fury coming out for Roxico. A lot of Sean's burst was really out of the way as Roxico tries to roll away. Fist of Fury coming back for Sean. Trying to get a nut. He's really trying to get chi that chi burst out. Why do monks care so much about that chi burst? It's not. This isn't the Warlords of Jenner. And Sean almost saw, almost noticed that Roxico had a port set up. Sean still has a chance, I think. Incap comes in, heavily DR'd, no more availability for it. Tries to catch up to Roxigo with Fist of Fury, but Roxigo just keeps running it, kind of like I kept running away from Roxigo. This time Roxigo gets to go for damage, does have Serenity up, we do have a Karma out of Sean. Roxigo drops down, ports away, trying to heal through it. That touch of death really hit Roxigo pretty damn hard back though. And Roxigo still staying in, getting incapped on. Stun comes in, trinket available, Karma's into Sean. Sean needs to suppress all that damage as soon as he can. Roxy goes back to chase with Sean. Sean actually uses Roxy's tricks to teleport back. Incap comes out. Maybe Fist of Fury to follow. Yep, Fist of Fury just to keep the damage down. Use Fist of Fury, not for damage, but rather to get the sun going. And now Sean is going in full damage serenity with Fist of Fury opener. Roxy go ports away. Dragon Kick away. Both of them are chasing after each other. Roxy and Sean are very similar health. Both of the monks decide that we need to stop. Need to has cast heals. Needs to get himself up to full. Now it's a question of who has what. From this add-on doesn't really work that well, but I can see Leg Sweep, I can see Karma. Not sure if Roxigo still has any of those things available. Roxigo does juke Sean really quick with that port. The port available for Sean or anything. E cap comes in for Sean. Roxigo pre walls it though, when Sean notices the pre wall has happened, backs away, goes to heal himself, and now Roxigo is going on the offensive. Will Sean do the same thing? No, didn't pre wall it. Incap comes in. Stun Serenity for Roxigo. Is he going to be able to chain those stuns together properly? No, not quite. Now Sean is the one going on the offensive with wall available. Fist of Fury coming out for Roxigo. Sean responds with his Fist of Fury. Both of them are very similar health. And now wall coming out for Sean. Roxigo getting a port to get a little bit extra healing. Sean is staying in. Both of them are just kicking and tussling and punching and kicking and screaming and now running away from each other. Roxigo trying to get out, gets an incap onto Sean, takes over the box, runs around the box completely. Has a port available, and that's what we were expecting. Dragon kicks away, Sean is going the offensive. Karma coming out, out of Roxigo. Is it going to be a follow-up Karma out of Sean onto Roxigo? Doesn't look like it. Sean, no, Sean is Karma in back now. Roxigo going for a fuses back to back, can't be stunned or anything. Gets incapped as he tries to get away from Sean, continues to run. Both Karmas have been forced. Now Touch of Death getting onto Sean, getting short stunned. Sean might take a lot of damage right here. Sean is also going in for Touch of Death himself. Trying to touch a death the other guy. They're trying to out touch a death each other. How hard is this touch of death gonna hit rocks? Go hits him for so much. Both of them under 1 million health. Both of them so low, about 500k hovering. Both are just going offensive. Sean picking up a little bit extra health. Going in with Touch of Fury. Fist of Fury takes out rocks. Go in a quick moment. An easy lad going up next. Gonna try to take out Sean. Tricky coming out of Sean instantly. Ink cap comes in onto easy lad. Gonna be able to bust out of it with unbreakable will. Still on a prowl and does swipe Sean out. Who's up next? Now it looks like we're gonna have Landosaur and Easy Lad. Pally versus Pally. We have Monk versus Monk. Pally versus Pally. We'll see where that goes. Easy Lad trying to keep a distance from Landosaur. Hand of Freedoms are both getting traded out for both of them. Chasing after each other. It looks like Easy Lad popped Shield of Vengeance and that got procced way early without Landosaur being anywhere nearby. Easy Lad is taking a bit of damage right now. No wings available or nothing. Easy Lad going in for full wings. Shield of Vengeance coming out for Landosaur. Stun comes in. Easy Lad trinkets it off the bat. 
Easy Lad is still taking a lot of damage. Bubble early. Didn't get an insta bubble. Just bubbled out early. Lad is still trying to maintain his bubble, trying to keep himself in. Flash of lights are coming out very, very late. Might even be able to stay in. Easy Lad has super low health. Trying to get a blind, and I think Kick comes out, and Lad will take him out without needing to break out of his bubble. Trying to go for heals against Fear's damage, and hopefully he didn't get kicked on it. Fear coming out, forcing a breakable will. Fear's damage trying to force that bubble real quickly without taking too much damage. Trick is out and actually does force bubble and then someone for full damage and fears just leaped away. Does have his big heal, won't be able to capitalize and cash out and might be able to get does what does get one bloodthirst out on it. Landersaur is just pummeling Fierce damage out back and forth, back and forth. Both of them just going ham. Fierce damage so low on health. Needs to start healing. No way of going about it. It's a fury. And does get taken out. And that's how we start the first end of the duel. Woo! God damn, everybody! Good fucking shit. Good fucking duel. Let's redo the groups. Let's hop back in there. New groups. We'll get everybody in. And then we'll start getting the all-stars in here, man. We'll start getting all-stars afterwards. Alrighty. Let me close it out. Open the group. Let me get Zillion in here, man. Let me get... Let me get Zillion.